Hey guys, it's Di from Bee Mommy with Style, and today I'm going to do a quick and easy Halloween craft for the girls. I'm going to be making one of those no sew tutus out of some tulle that I got in some Halloween colors for a dollar at Target. Or no, not at Target, at Walmart. See, I can't even say it. <laughs> Walmart. Anyhow, um, I got this glittery one in green. I got this glittery one in orange. And I got this purple one. And I also linked down below, I did a tutorial a long time ago for the pink and purple ones that you guys will see the girls wear a lot. So this is just one of those baby headbands. And I have been repurposing the ones that the girls wore as babies, actually. And they don't use these, obviously, anymore. So I have just been using these to make the little tutus. And that works out great. So this is just a standard size headband and this one's a little bit wider than usual but the little one inch ones work perfect for this. These fit on my daughters around their waist. My two year old is on the small size and she's probably about 33 inches and 23 to 25 pounds. My older daughter is about 40 inches and she is about 33 pounds and so they fit both of them just fine. I think it would easily fit up to like a six year old and then after that you may need a some sort of bigger headband but these stretch a ton so all I'm gonna do is loop through on the bottom loops you can see these kind of pull apart this stretches a ton I'm just gonna loop a different color through and alternate green orange purple and then this is a kind of sparkly purple headband and we're gonna make a Halloween themed tutu out of this I know the girls love wearing these. So I'm first of all gonna just alternate between the three colors. You can see that these stretch a ton and these baby headbands fit around the waist of my two-year-old and my four-year-old and I think would probably fit easily up to a child of about six years old or so. After that, you may need to source some other thing for the waist, but I'm sure there are some other things out there that you could do to make these in a similar way. You can see that these stretch out and there's holes along the bottom. So I'm just gonna be using these holes to put my tool through and this is no sew so I'm just gonna poke it through and kind of pull it through I'll show you the method that I use and it lasts a really long time we have had those tutus in the pink and the purple for probably close to two years now the girls are still using them and they have held up just fine so first of all I'm gonna cut a number of links in my three different tools and you just want to judge by the length of skirt that you want and then double it so my glitter is already getting everywhere from the green Anyhow, um, whatever the length of the skirt that you want is, you know, you want to measure that down this way from the headband and then you just want to double it over so that you have doubled the length that makes it a little bit fuller typically around 12 to 18 inches I think is good for girls around my age and you may want to make it a little bit longer for girls that are older and I'm when I say 12 I mean down on one side so you double it and be about 24 so I'm just going to approximate I'm not going to be um, specific but I'm just going to kind of eyeball it and then I'm gonna cut a number of these links and start putting them through the skirt. And I will just warn you right now, this glitter tool that I got for a doll glitter is everywhere. It's already all over the table. So just to warn you, if you get this at Walmart, I don't know if I just said Target or not, but if you get this at Walmart, the glitter gets everywhere. So I may only let the girls wear these outside because they're getting glitter all over the place. But they are still very, very cute in this glittery tool. You can see on the ends I'm not being exact as far as where I cut it because quite frankly I think it gives it a little bit more better look for Halloween anyways to have like these jagged edges on there so I'm not cutting it off and honestly after they wear it it gets all kind of scrunched up anyways and you could never tell whether it was straight or not so I'm really just kind of you know estimating everything and that works really well for this one. So to start out I'm just going to grab the tool by the top and then I'm going to pinch it together to make a loop. So there's kind of your loop at the top. You're gonna to punch that loop through the band. So I just separated my hole out like that where you can get things through there and then I pulled the loop through the band. Actually there in the back you can see it comes through. Then I'm gonna put it down at the bottom of the skirt and pull the tool down. So I've just taken the tool and gone through the loop and then from there I'm just gonna pull that straight down and that will be my skirt. So there it is pulled down and then it's gonna pull it tighter and then just pull the tool through and make this part tight at the top. Wrap the green through and I'm just going to pull that down to tighten. And then I'm just going to continue down the band all the way until it is full and I'm just going to alternate orange, purple, green. Alright, so here's how it's coming along so far and then I'm just going to continue on around the headband just adding in orange, purple, green. 
All right, and there you go. You have a super sparkly Halloween tutu. And I'm actually going to go pick up some more headbands, and I think I'm going to do one of these in orange purple and black and do some different colors and this one the glitter is getting everywhere so this is definitely not one that we will use inside this will just be an outside maybe trick-or-treating type of one but I'm gonna go get some tool that doesn't have the glitter on it so the girls can run around in their Halloween tutus inside so hopefully if you've been wondering how to spice up one of your Halloween outfits this will give you some ideas on how to make a no sew tutu let me know if you have any questions down below and thanks so much for watching have a great day